feel something in this place. Something I haven't felt since I was a child. When my father would go insane with rage, I would hide with my brother, and he would tell me the tale of Pania of the Reef. I remember feeling the ocean calling to me. I wanted to escape, to give myself to the silent sea. And now, as I look at the reefs surrounding this beach, I feel that urge again. I see Pania's green seaweed hair woven among the wreckage. I feel her tears in the spray of the waves lashing upon the rocks. Lara is right. This island is cursed. There is a rage here that will never let us go. If the worst happens and I'm the last one standing, I will let Pania take me. I will swim away and join my brother in the waves. Roth, I know you want me to ease off Lara, but I'm hard on her for a reason. This big, expensive ship and all its people are heading into uncharted, dangerous waters based on her theories. Lara needs to understand the weight of that responsibility. I know it was your call, but sometimes I think you forget that she isn't actually your daughter. No one else could get away with steering the Endurance into the Dragon's Triangle without at least some hard evidence. So you tell me, what convinced you? She's smart, I'll give her that. And I admit the expedition has potential. But big ideas and grand plans will only get us so far. You know as well as I do, nothing like this ever goes according to plan. Lara's green. If the shit hits the fan and she screws up, someone's gonna get hurt. Maybe it'll all play out fine. But until we're sailing home safe and sound with a pile of riches, I'm not giving that girl any slack. Grab some tools for Reyes. Jonah, give the hoist a try. This has got to be our best chance, right? We've got to try. I'm glad you decided to join us, Lara. What can I do to help? Help Jonah. lift him more smoothly with some kind of block and tackle. You're right. I should be able to fashion one from some pulleys. There might be some on that rigging we can use. I'll check it out. Be careful, Lara.
What's wrong? Alex should have been back by now. Help! Help! It's Dr. Whitman. Jonah, help! How many are there? I don't know. Are you hurt? I couldn't see anyone. <sighs> Must have scared them off. I feel like I've run for miles. And you've barely broken a sweat. Must be fitter than I thought. You could have led them straight to us, like you did back at the palace. What? That's not how it was, Laura. They, they, they caught me while you were getting Sam. What the hell is this about? They said it was the only way they'd let you and the others live. I, I tried to warn you. We don't have time for this. Look, I don't know what the problem is between the two of you, and to tell you the truth, I don't much care. I was only hoping Look, that... another word, and I swear to God, I'll start smashing that expensive dentistry of yours. Stop, stop, stop. If we fight amongst ourselves, then we lose. You're right. Which is why this is not happening, okay? I'm going off to Alex. Where were the tools? The engine room. Look, he can take care of himself, Lara. Good. Then we'll be back soon. Lara, wait! Here, take this bow. I've been saving it for you ever since I found it. It's powerful. You can shoot an arrow and do almost anything. Thank you, Jonah. You should wait for her. Lara? No. No, I got this. I'm heading in. Going radio silent. Alex, what are you doing?
That won't work. Coastal base has been attacked by unknown assailants. We suspect the Americans have arrived and are attempting to sabotage our operations. Communications have been disrupted across the island, and we've sustained heavy losses. Many of our soldiers have simply disappeared. 
All remaining personnel are proceeding to the ancient monastery to ensure control of the weather phenomenon. We expect to meet heavy resistance en route. Request reinforcements as soon as possible. Here she comes! Good shot! 